I like this one. Hey everybody, Matt here, and today I've got this very, very special guest. Uh, don't ask or email or call me and ask how this got into my office. It just did. It landed here. I haven't even opened it yet, but I happen to have the full bottle and a beautiful sample of this 2015 William LaRue Weller Buffalo Trace Antique Collection. 67.3% alcohol, 12 years old, and it is a true beast. It is beautiful. Everybody says weed is sweet, blah, blah, blah. I've never found that to be true. Actually, I find it to be kind of the opposite a little bit is that sweet tends, or wheat for me tends to produce this kind of dry herbaceous note in bourbon. Now, I don't find that in here uh, because this is such a big, complex spice bomb, but I find that true to, I find that to be the case in other weeded bourbons. So let's nose this monster. Oh, man. You could just sit with that for a long time. So I've nosed this a couple times now. Um, and the more I nose it, the sweeter and more caramel notes I'm getting. A little bit more vanilla. You have to nose these high alcohol bourbons several times. You have to kind of get your nose acclimated to it because of the alcohol. And once you do, that's when the real bourbon flavors start to emerge. The nuttiness, the leather, the caramel, the vanilla, the toffee. Whew, man. Okay, I'm gonna taste it now. No, not spitting today. Um, right on the front, you get the spice and you get a little bit of fruit, but then there is this total like caramel vanilla attack on the mid palate, a little bit of nuttiness and kind of leatheriness on the finish. But man, it's not minty. It's not super sweet, but it has a sweetness to it. I don't know how you're going to take that, but um, it just has got so much flavor going for it. 12 years old. Um, Barrel proof, more than barrel proof. Um, yeah, this is going to be rare and super hard to get. And if you're lucky enough to get a bottle of this, pop it immediately. Don't save it. Savor it. Enjoy it. And don't flip it. Cheers. Cheers.